It's like opening day at Yankee Stadium. I mean, we just just can't believe it's finally here. Beach Cafe owner Dave Goodside and his staff are making last minute preparations for outdoor dining as New York City prepares to enter phase two. We've got to make sure we wipe down menus. We have to have a six foot distance between tables. Uh, yeah, all the servers have to be wearing masks. The Beach Cafe owner is particularly proud of his Hamburgers for Hospital Heroes program, giving away more than 3,000 burgers, fries, and drinks to essential workers from the four hospitals near his 70th Street and 2nd Avenue restaurant. It was the best thing I ever got involved in. Besides outdoor dining, phase two includes barber shops and hair salons, the reopening of commercial buildings, business and real estate offices, in-store retail, in-person vehicle sales, leases and rentals, and playgrounds. But what remains closed, malls, indoor dining, large gathering event venues, gyms, nail salons, movie theaters, and indoor-outdoor places of public amusement. I think that we all have to have patience and we're out of phase one, so we're into phase two. And I think it's a wonderful feeling that we've watched the, the city bloom. But I got a little tired of doing my own hair. At Astor Place hairstylist, longtime manager Big Mike Saviello says all the protocols are in place. Masks, shields, disposable capes, temperatures taken of customers, COVID testing of staff every two weeks, and hair cutting stations sectioned off by plastic dividers. And the biggest change, every customer must make an appointment. So with 50% capacity, is that enough to pay your bills here? We had to we had to raise our prices. All right, so our, our haircuts used to be $18. They're going to be $23 now. And that extra $5 is not going in our pockets. That's going all for PPE.